Hello guys, you're welcome again to another tutorial. Today I want to show you how you can create an epic fantasy logo reveal like these ones. I'm gonna quickly show you how you can transform this video to this video in just a couple of steps inside CapCut. So support me on this one, do not forget to like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, then turn on the notification, come back, let's get started. Now inside CapCut, we're gonna create a new project, click the import button to import the clips you wanna use for these tutorials. I'm gonna select these two, then hit open. Then I'm going to drag this into the timeline right here. Drag the venues animation with the green screen on top of this. Put my playhead right here and click on this to split the video. Then I'm going to hit the delete button to delete the rest part of that. I made this inside After Effects. If you want to download this, you will find a link in the description where it will take you to where you download this video. I have multiple styles in it. Once you download the videos, you will find the Earth, Jupiter, all type of planets I have made inside After Effects rotating. You can find it inside this folder. Let's come back to inside CapCut where we'll get this going. So what I'm gonna do now is to select this footage on top, then go to remove background, select the chroma key, Pick the eyedropper and then select the color you want to remove and that is going to automatically remove the color. Go back to basics and then scale this up as much as you can. Then go to mask. I'm going to select the horizontal split. I'm going to rotate this a bit. Scroll down to increase the feather. Feel free to play around with the position. Select the footage below the planet, hold the Alt key, drag and drop it right on top. That is going to create a duplicate overlay for this video. So I'm going to go to remove BG again and select the auto removal. You're going to wait for this for a while. It is going to remove this character right here. So it is done. It has automatically removed the background from this character. So what we're going to do again is to select the bottom layer right here, hold the Alt key, duplicate it one more time right on top of the green screen planet. So what I'm going to do is go to the mask again and select the vertical or horizontal. Then I'm going to turn this like this and then move it right below right here. Then I'm going to increase the mask also so that I'll have a blended environment with this. I'm going to add more effect. So I'm going to go here and import more. So I'm going to import this image right here. Place it right below the planet. Stretch this to fill our timeline so that we'll have the same thing. Then I'm going to go to the basics tab and then scale this up quite a bit. Then I'm going to move it so I can see the moon. Then I'm going to go down and check the blend mode and then blend check again so that it will reveal the opacity. So I'm going to reduce the opacity a bit. It is time to bring in the logo and then animate it into this. I'm still going to go to import. Import the logo. Feel free to use whatever logo you have. Add this on top of everything. Scale down. So I'm going to select this one. I'll go to animation. Then I'll add a simple fade in. Then I'll also select this and add a simple zoom in like this. Beautiful. So I'm just going to arrange this so that it will perfectly sit on my timeline. So if you play everything now, this is what you have. Within a short time, an epic logo reveal animation is ready that can increase engagement on your content as a content creator. So this is how you can create an epic fantasy logo reveal animation inside CapCut within few steps. If you learned something new on this video, please hit the like button that will enable the algorithm to suggest this to more people. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me in the comment section and I'll reply to all questions as quick as I can. 
if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please subscribe to my youtube channel you can support me in any way you can give me super thanks subscribe to my membership whatever way you want to support me with even if you share the video that is also a huge support and it is highly appreciated if you like the video leaving a comment is all a support so with whatever way you are able to support me I highly appreciate you. So until I see you again on the next one, my name is SSB Otaru from Motion Digit Studios.